Now if you want to take a look at that, what that looks like in uh, 3D, just click on your Perspective tab and it allows you to have a, a close look. And here you see we have the rich cliff paver and a, a double row of quartz stone around the perimeter. Now that's what comes in automatically as a default, but these materials can easily be changed. If we go over to the Materials tab, we can change our uh, our driveway to another product. We can go uh, over to um, Il Campo, for example, oak wood, and we'll put that in. That's one color that we could choose, and we could also change up the uh, the border if we wanted to. Let's uh, let's put that back to uh, Richcliff. That looked good with this house. And we've go over to border here, and let's say we want to change that over to a copthorn soldier. We'll click on copthorn here, and we'll put our soldier in. Of course, copthorn's only eight inches wide, so we'll make that adjustment. Now, if we wanted to make that a double row, we simply would take this and put in 16 inches as our distance, and now we have a double row of. Uh, copthorn all the way around the perimeter of the driveway.